Jim Davis securing yet another victory here. Yep. Out of the way, boys. Not a problem. Jim's in town. All right, so everyone's welcome. Uh, world champ prep continues, and this one's a bit of a brewski. Um, pull this deck off untapped.gg, uh, where untapped player Nithin has uh, played this deck to a 47 and 24 record in Mythic, which is pretty impressive, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is a Is It Capricious Hellraiser deck. All right, red, 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 three, four, four, cost three of us to cast. You have nine or more cards in your graveyard. And when you cast it, uh, and exile three cards at random from your graveyard, choose a non-creature, non-land from among them, and copy it. So a lot of a random element here, obviously, but Flash of Back of Spell is great. Uh, the randomness is a little weird, uh, but that's just, I, I don't know, it's still pretty powerful. So uh, goal here is try to Season of Weaving, so you can copy the Hellraiser twice and make two more copies, kind of go off from there, and then hopefully find a reunion and give them haste. Also, Shadow's a big thing here, too. It's kind of like big is it stuff. You know, we saw this a lot uh, in the All Runs Symphony Standard format where there are a bunch of decks just playing is it stuff and kind of going from there. Uh, this is the kind of thing where I, I don't think this deck, like as presented, is going to win worlds. But I think it's really important to explore options and try different things and kind of just get a feel for, uh, for what's going on because. There's good ideas, lots of places. You need to kind of go and find them, too. So, deck looks crazy. Obviously, this person's been winning a lot with it, which is cool. And uh, they also apparently made a primer, uh, which you can find on, like, I don't know, Twitter or something. Someone can post a link for it and chat it. That would be cool. But, cool. So, let's get right the games. Brought to you by Rogue. I just finished today's Rogue. And there it is. It's all empty. It's so empty, you can see right through it. All right? Check out Rogue Energy. I'm a huge fan of their hydration line. Uh, I have one almost every day. Uh, five calories, no sugar, no caffeine. And of course, they have they have the traditional traditional energy drinks as well. Check those out. And the chill line, I like a lot too. Big savings. Promo code Jim Davis MTG for twenty percent off your order at RogueEnergy.com. Buy a tub; it'll last you for like two months. Honestly, it's actually pretty insane. Check them out. RogueEnergy.com. Chat coming out with me. But is it good? We're going to find out, folks. We're going to find out. Three steps. Season of Weaving. Torch Tower. So I kind of like the, you know, combo control deck. So how sugary? Well, there's very little sugar. There's actually no sugar in them, so not very. And I recommend uh, for Rogue, you want to use uh, about two-thirds of the recommended serving. Uh, otherwise, I find it too strong, which is great because it means you get, like, you know, 30% more in your package. So... All right, uh, Heartfire here on one off Inspiring Vantage. Uh, that thing is dead. Get off my You're out of here. Exiled it. No triggers. Love to see it. Uh, I have a, a Boros version of the uh, kind of like heroic deck. Oh, this is an actual just mouse deck. Sure. So here's Valley Quest Caller. All right. Not the usual. Um, not the usual. Dump this. Not the usual uh, just like, you know, Red Prowess aggro deck. The chill line's cool. Uh, I don't think it like, oh wow, what are they doing over here? We're off the map, folks. Waka, waka. Uh, Thrill Seeker, Quest Caller, sure. Uh, the chill line's great though, I like it a lot. Uh, so we can go Tunnel Girder here, or just leave up three steps ahead. I'm just gonna say go. I don't know what's going on here, yeah, I'm, I'm lost. Like, I guess Thrill Seekering the Heartfire Hero is kind of cute, but, like, here's Manifold Mouse. No Offspring. Uh, we're still going to counter this. Uh, all right. Pawn is cooking something. Just the old mice. There's Monstrous Rage. Okay. I mean, are they going to fling and just... Alright, I guess. We've got a weird deck, right? Like, we're dead. They killed us. Great. I mean, that's cool, but... I... We have one, we have two into the Flood Maw. We can Brass this Tunnel, tunnel Girder into a Flood Maw. I think we just guard our entire hand. Try and find this Flood Maw. We could keep the Hellraiser. It's obviously, like, a big deal, but, like, if we don't draw Flood Maw, we should we just die. So maybe we just, like, just do it. Just go all the way here. Discard any number of cards. Draw that many cards plus one. Um, 
Hellraiser is the point of a deck. Whatever. Just do it. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel, folks. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No Flood Moth. All right. Interesting start to our uh, to our run here. Opponent's playing a very aggressive, like, weird version of, like, Mice Prowess. Uh, we're going to bring in a Braid, Pyroclasm. You've got a Shock in the board. Wow. Uh, and we're going to cut... I mean, there's plenty of clunky cards to cut, you know? Three steps seems kind of bad against them. Uh, basically, any wheel spinny stuff. You know, like, a, these tunnel girders. Um, Pyroclasm, Fires of Victory, Bitter Reunion. I would say Bitter Reunion's kind of sketchy, too, right? We really need to, like, haste. I don't think. Let's try this. All right, on the play. Got Pyroclasm. We're going to keep. Uh, I'm just going to get a blue off this. Planes? Yeah, they are like an actual factual mouse deck. Sure. Uh, all right, get an island. When's Worlds? In Vegas in two and a half weeks. Going to be a little greedy with the power class them. And Bar if they played the 2 3 Lord, they'd be actually just get like, lost, but now we actually just, you know, wham, this is really good for us, so. Fire Power Classroom. Let it ride. Any mods in chat? And they fire a Toscana's Welcome. Sure. I mean, it's a lot, it's a lot of six drops. Here's Ember Heart Challenger again. Draw a card. And we draw on a braid. Sure, I mean... Do they have a... If they have Monstrous Rage, this survives. Ugh. The good news is they can't... They can't... We, we, we stop the Rage and this goes away, so... There's some value there. Mabel. I... Yeah, I don't, I don't know what's going on, folks. I uh, just... We're, I mean, we're getting, we're getting crushed, too. I mean, we have this now. We have the Chandra. So you could like Chandra minus four kill both of them. Assuming no all mana spell, which would lose the game for us, but sure. I'm in. Yeah, the Hellraiser doesn't have a uh... graveyard. Choose a knocker among them and copy it. Yeah, that's not very good. Uh I could also season, I guess. That's true. Just like draw, draw, return each non-land. Non That's actually pretty good. Maybe we'll do that. This has haste, but bouncing the welcome is kind of cool too. Eh, let's do that. Sure. We'll season. We'll go uh, return all the stuff and then draw two. It puts it in the graveyard for the, uh, the Hellraiser too. It's a card. You know, card's kind of ruining it, but... <laughs> I made fun of a dog. Double season with Chandra. That doesn't seem very good, right? So they need to decide how aggressive they want to be here. Here's Charge Challenger. Here's the equip. Oh, Karn's mad I made fun of him now. They hit an Archangel. Their deck is just like all over the place. Uh, all right. I kind of want to Roaring Furnace and kill this Challenger. And then... Hellraiser requires a lot more. It's funny we could like try it, Hellraiser and get lucky, but like that's a weird card to build around, you know. Um, we could also Chandra plus Furnace kill this. I kind of like that. Um, yeah, we could play Hellraiser, but like if we just don't hit the seizing season, like we just don't do anything, you know. So we have a, a one in three shot of hitting it, which doesn't seem very good. Uh, Karn's gone. He's out. He's had enough. All right. We're just going to uh, Chandra plus. Time to light up the darkness. Two mana. Red, red. Play Furnace. Kill Challenger. Pretty good card. Furnace. Cool one. 
and Sega. They play a sword missing. Give haste. It does give haste, actually. Wow, okay, so. Unfortunately, this sword is going to keep chipping away here. Uh, we draw Shivan Reef. So we've got four cards in the bin. We could Tunnel Girder, uh, discarding three cards. Set up for the cheaper Hellraiser. And then copy. I think I'm in. Double Flood Maw is a thing, but I think I want to just go deeper. We've got four in the bin. This will put five, six, seven in the bin. Oh, we need nine in the bin. Jeez. One second. Oh, okay. Right. I'm sorry. I, I, misread, I misread the, the Hellraiser. So we just go for the Hellraiser now, I think. Yeah. Let's play a land. Yeah, and hold up Flood Maw. I like that. So... Let's go play Hellraiser. We got... <laughs> so we had a, a three out of four chance to hit our, our season and didn't. Uh, choose a non-creature online card among them and copy it. Maybe try to copy that mana clause. Okay. So we'll... Destroy this. It copies it. Target again. Uh, sure. And I guess we'll add red, red, and cast bitter reunion. Just have flood maw up. Flood maw can't even bounce our own creature, right? Ugh. Give me actual on summon, you know. Let's discard tunnel girder. Okay, we draw another Hellraiser. All right. Well, we can... Next turn, we're guaranteed to hit it, right? So... Say go with Flood Maw up. What a weird game. <laughs> like... Scott is welcome. Sure. All right. Well, I mean, we should be able to do it to do the thing. Um... Right, like, so now we have Hellraiser again. I'm going to add red, red, so I have more mana to work with, I think. Let's go. Play Hellraiser. Exile Carson Graveyard. Choose Season of Weaving. Cast Season of Weaving. Uh, copy, copy, draw. Draw, copy, copy, draw, copy, copy. Right, Are you Really, uh... Weird roundabout game, but sure. That was our only bitters I boarded them out to. I mean, I was wrong. I mean, obviously, we just make seven dragons and win the game next turn. That's fine, you know? I don't think you need the bitter reunions, but uh, okay. Artist talent. I think talent's worse than reunion, actually. I'll leave his Ben. He's back in. Uh, yeah, let's just try and do it again, I guess. It's I don't know what's going on, folks. Point of Mulligans. We can keep this, I guess. We have a, we have a thousand looks. Casino, is it? Hard fire hero, sure. The fourth Thundering Falls. What is going on, all right? Somebody's playing a prank on me. All right. Um, we have a reunion to draw a lot of cards next turn, so... They play a tap lens, they go. Okay, sure. So, the world's coming with the arena meta. Yeah, obviously the meta game will change entirely after worlds. So, all right, let's reunion. Let's discard a one of these tap lands and draw land tunnel girder. It's funny, we might just tunnel girder our whole hand here, honestly. 
There's Manifold Mouse. That's pretty good. If we tunnel girder our entire hand, that puts... Or actually one short. Oh, we drew Explosion too. Alright, so... We want to Explosion next turn. So let's tunnel girder... Discarding everything but Explosion and Season of Weaving. And set up the cast Explosion next turn, discarding Weaving. Sure. One, two, three, four. We draw another explosion. Okay, and now I discard for the explosion. Cheeky house mouse? What is going on? We're getting cheeky, folks. They have fling, I'm dead, right? Will they even have fling? That is six. I guess I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to go on a three, right? But they missed a land draw, that's cool. Alright, so just play a land, play explosion. We draw, we'll discard Season of Weaving and then a land. Sure. We also descend for our tunnel girder. Take three. This is the turn. If we get to untap safely here, I'll feel, I'll feel reasonably good about things. If you give a mouse a cookie. Yeah, here's Tunnel Girder. Um, I think we just Tunnel Girder a bunch of cards again. Tunnel Girder will also flip over in the end step. I have a right up for my Torch Tower, which is kind of cool. I also want a Pyroclasm, though. I think we Tunnel Girder discarding... Keep this one. Definitely three lands. And I think I'm going to Pyroclasm the mouse and have Torch Tower up also. We have to draw, if we have to draw, we're drawing four cards while we draw land. I just have this explosion too, right? Yeah, I think we're going to. So let's do this. Discard these four. Draw a bunch of stuff. Play a land. Cast Pyroclasm. Say go. Descend and flip. Okay. So now if I cast a permanent spell, I get to discover X. Here's Heartfire Hero. Uh, we want to exile this thing. So it'll take damage if they have a monster. I mean, if they have a monster, we would have cast it probably earlier, but I'm going to play it super safe here. Uh, I'm just going to bargain. Target this. Top card's Hellraiser. Awesome. I mean, now nah, I wish I kept the thing in play, but whatever. Okay. So now we're going to Hellraiser. But we're getting a, a random... Oh my god, this is a trip. So, exile three cards random from your graveyard. Choose one from among them and copy it. So, a lot of them are removal spells and stuff. We have a seat in there. Um... Dewey Chandra, Cascade, Make Red, and Discover. Sure. So let's cut. Let's cast Chandra. Discover six. Revealing Bitter Reunion. Oh, Hold on, we might get there. Oh let's discard extra Chandra. Draw two towards the tower. Make Red Red. We have to win this fight. Well, I guess I don't have mad at actually do it, but whatever. So, Hellraiser. We can cast Tunnel Girder or Real Time Explosion. Okay. This card is uh, a little random. We'll draw four here. Uh, discard none. Discard none. Like, I feel like we're doing so much stuff, but it's not, I don't, we're not like necessarily doing a thing either. Like, I think the game's over. I don't think we can lose at this point. But we've taken a lot of game actions, yeah. All right, let's just cast Hellraiser again. Cascade. This time revealing a shock. Okay. Nugia. Oh, it copies it, right? I could kill Mabel. That's stupid, whatever. Uh, we have a Brains. I think we're fine. So Hellraiser. Exile three. 
We hit the season. Oh, All right. Oh my God. Uh, so copy, copy, draw. I guess we've already wasted our Chandra this turn. That's fine. Which is 4, 8, 12, 16. These also trigger. We'll cast Shock again. And the game, it's over. Is this like broken? <laughs> All right, sure. Let's just keep going, I guess. All right. Uh, <laughs> waka, waka. That's a hand of the week, folks. All right, that is a hand of the week. All right, opponent mulligans. We're also going to mulligan. Um, I don't know why I'd mulligan this perfect hand, but sure, this is good. Let's keep this. Ship a land. We got a lot of uh, search here. All right, so just an Overlord deck. I mean, imagine like combo is good against the Overlord deck. So Thundering Falls, second Tunnel Girder goes to the bin. Karn's mad about something. Karn is mad. Mad dog. All right, Bitter Reunion. Discard Torch the Tower. A lot of velocity for this deck, you know? They miss a land drop. Aww. Make a little noise here, huh? Come on, I can't hear you! No more lies? This is Ash's deck, right? All right, Jesus Christ. Expecting that one, God. Good old rock. Nothing beats that. <laughs> I'd love to tell you I'm cyborg and the car just keeps barking, so figure it out. sometimes. I don't know what's going on out there, but Karn does not like it. Mulligan again? Come on. All right, Mulligan. Done? Is he finally done? Unbelievable. All right, blue, white. So this is just like the domain deck with with no more lies and stuff. Um, what the hell's Karn's problem, Mama? We had our first trick or treater. No, she's just a delivery person, but I gave him some Halloween candy because we have too much and we never get trick or treater. So you gave our delivery person Halloween candy? Yeah. Aww. That's great. Yeah, I, mean, I, I think it's great. It's better just... for me to not eat it. Um, all right, I'll just take it. So, so who was it? Is it the other person's name? Anything cool? Prob probably. All right, so end step, moment of truth. Uh, take the Hellraiser. Put the put the land in the grape. Well, I guess this thing can... Actually, you can't copy. Never mind. Put it in the library. Sure. All right. Anyway, um... Spire Bluff Canal. I guess we'll just fire up a tunnel girder. 
they're going to know more lives than ever I cast. So, I think Bitter Union is actually a better. Let's do that. Bitter Union. Yeah, they're play, literally going to play No More Lies. I could play a Grizzly Bear and they'll cast No More Lies. So, play Canal House, they go. Tunnel Girder for. Things like Tunnel Girder is not going to be that good. We only have to discard. Here's Beans. That's annoying. Um. Cavern on Dragon. Um, they probably have another No More Lies, but whatever, sure. Tunnel Girder. Yeah, that is a lot of No More Lies. Alright, so play Lance, they go. We want to get this season in the graveyard. We can just cast it, I guess. Here is Helga, Skittish Seer. So, cast creature spell mana by four greater, draw a card, gain a life, and taps your mana for big things. And we don't have a lot going on here, unfortunately. Well, they stopped all my engine pieces, you know? Even, it even exiles them, too. It's annoying. They're just saying, go again? What? Inconceivable! Alright, so... We could just drag in here, but there's nothing, nothing good in our graveyard. If we cast Season and they no more lies it, it gets exiled, which is awful for us, obviously. Uh, like, but, wait, I, sure, whatever, I guess. Like, I think doing nothing this turn is not a reasonable thing to do, so, whatever. Yes, it's the gate. That's what I was hoping for. All right, sweet. We're all rolled up, folks. We actually have a guaranteed season next turn. The problem is they have Sunfall. They can just stop my... I might have the gate, though, so... All right, so... Well, I guess the problem is that we're a mana short. If we're going to gate Sunfall. No! No! Predictable bar always takes rock. My graveyard, my beautiful graveyard. All right, well, let's just draw two cards, I guess. All right, decline, and we have tide binder and demolition field. Oh, sure, I guess it does, it does actually exile the lands too. You just can't cast them. That's fine. I might just tie binder here and just block the frill back. Uh, give me back my graveyard, you bastard. Uh, demolition fielding them is like kind of whatever. Yeah, so sure. I guess it's fine. I'll block Helga. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Yeah, I'll block this, obviously. I have a binding. I say, yeah, sure. That's it. That doesn't matter. Same thing. So, all right. So. They binding. Take three. Guess that was a bad block. Ah, they, they just block and trade it otherwise, so. Name Avatar. Draw another land. She got lands for, for days here. Oh, my cast Hellraiser, we're guaranteed just to draw two cards. Which honestly might be worth it at this point. Just name Dragon. Play Hellraiser. ETB. Draw two. That's a lot of work for a Mole Drifter, alright? They're going to negate the ill-timed explosion. Okay. The problem is if I just ever draw a card that costs four more, we lose the game on the spot, basically. Hmm. Nissa Ascended Animist. Nope. Get off my plane. Did you draw a card? This only counts creature spells. Avatar Overlord. Draw a card. Draw a card. Spawn an Overlord. We draw Restless Spire. Alright. I can actually Field of Ruin the Everywhere. That's kind of cool. Um. Okay. 
many bases do I have left? I've got three. Three basics left. Here's Wrestle Spire. And then I guess we just say go. I could have ill timed explosion and killed these, I guess. But it costs two cards, you know? Oh, they failed to find? I didn't even notice. That's kind of guess. Uh. So it's just storm rain again, I guess. I don't think it matters that much at this point, but whatever. Given the option to stone rain or not, I choose stone rain. Don't draw the last basic, please. All right, embarrassing games of magic here. Let's fire up the old Wrestle Spire and uh, attack. Real scrappy, crappy game here. Neither player doing very much. Scry one. Keep that one on top. And, all right. So if they brick, I get to copy my Hellraiser. All right. I mean, we're, I'm sorry. We're, we're three-fourths to copy our Hellraiser. All right, maybe he doesn't work out for us, but. This is definitely one of the game of magics of all time. All right, so maze. Impending. Okay, so untap, draw season. So, return each non-land, non-token permanent to its owner's hand. If I bounce... No, I'm just gonna draw, draw copy copy. The next one might do the bounce thing. So I can keep my, my dragons and bounce all their stuff. Um, attacking first, I think might be wrong. Because you want to draw into a bitter reunion to try and kill them in one shot. Tony reset, thanks so much. So I think we sack this first. Yeah. Get a land. I think we season, copy, copy, draw. And go from there. They drew a binding they would cast it on their turn, I'm pretty sure, to draw the cards. So. Copy this. Trigger the Hellraisers. Oh, I guess we're guaranteed to get season, right? So. They're gonna tie binder one of the dragons. Okay. Interesting. So we are we're three out of five to hit this. Oh, sacking of a land was really bad, actually. I don't want to draw the basic, but I just reduced my odds of hitting the season. I guess we didn't know that, right? Because we had we had two dragons. We didn't know this tie binder was coming, so that's fair. Alright, so. We hit it! Oh, it's Wendy Helix! Season. Oh my god! Now, this season, do we want to... This is no flying. Now there's nothing in the graveyard to copy. We just draw five cards and try and draw the haste thing. I think we just draw five. So, it's copying the dragon isn't even that good anymore. Because there's nothing to get. So, this is get like exile, right? Yeah, okay, so let's just draw 10. Or 5. 5. Oh, we did it. Make a little noise here, huh? Uh, okay. Let's cast Bitter Union. Come on, I can't hear you. They have second Tide Binder. It'd be pretty funny. No! No more lies. That's fine. All right, so. We haven't played a land yet. They were all tap lands anyway, but I didn't waste the mana. So, all right. So let's just Thundering Falls. Been a land. We need to not die here. So like with double Hellraiser in the bin. I'm gonna cast this now. See what we hit. That's a lot of stuff. This just kills them, right? Just fireballs them. All right. Sure. Uh. Okay, so if I attack and they draw a removal spell, I might die. This fireballs them for five. I can dragon also. I think we say go. I think we have a really good chance to win the game next turn. 
Uh, and I'm not going to risk them killing me and get, getting, uh, getting cheesed out. That's a good draw. That changes the math significantly, but sure. So draw two, make two blockers. All right. I mean, the shotter can kill the insects. Okay. We draw a tide binder. We can cast Hellraiser, probably copy Moment of Truth. In theory, though, Chandra just wins the game. We just Chandra kill both these and attack for eight and kill them. Um, how does that go wrong? They have a negate. They have like, do we get tie binder? Their tie binder too. All right, yeah, I think we just try and cast Chandra win. Um, we can't play Hellars if we do if, we, if this misses though. Yeah, we'll just go for it. That was all really fast. All right. Somehow, we're 2-0 with this deck. <laughs> On the play. Hopefully playing creatures, we're gonna keep. See, Snid. Tunnel Guard is great, keep that. Reset, thanks so much. Dark Slick Shores. Mockingbird as a 1-1. One -one. That is aggressive. Uh, I think I want to just go tap land tunnel girder. I guess we'll just hold this torch. Like, it's literally just a flying man, but like, we do want to keep him off the board. I think if they do nothing, I'll just torch it. Deep, uh, even better. Even better. Say it, chat. Get off my plate. Get out of here, you stupid bat. Look at my hand. Look at it and awe. They get the look. Looky, no touch. Looky, no touch, friend. Bitter, sure. Spiral of Canal. We're gonna girder and just discard. Definitely these three. I'm sorry, these three. Do I want to keep the furnace as our removal spell? Uh, I'm trying to go deeper. I'm trying to go deeper, I think. All right, we draw. We draw some stuff. Um, I've seen better, but artist talent does fuel the girder. Here's Gex, which is annoying. So they got a card off the uh, Mockingbird, but it's fine. Just kill the Gex. So we'll go talent, fires, kill Gix, and set up the girder. So discard a land, draw a card, triggers the descend. Ugh. All right, deep cabin bat number two, sure. No engine's the important part. They've got to keep the Gix off the table. As long as they aren't drawing cards, we're okay. We're just season of weaving. I mean, Demo Ocean Field does get the girder going. That's kind of cool. So we're just Demo Field. I guess I get a third mana either way, right? So let's target the shores. Let's target the river, actually. So they don't get three mana on the end step. Um... I don't really care about chip shot damage, I don't think, so. All right, so get a mountain. And we'll just level this, I guess. So our spells cost one less. Here's Fairy Mastermind, sure. Now we have a Searing Rift, which can cascade. They attack for a chip. I mean, if they have counter spells here, we're like in pretty big trouble, honestly. But what are you gonna do? All right, so I'm gonna try and season to bounce stuff and then draw cards. Oh, you draw the cards first. That sucks. 
All right. Uh, like, if they have the 4 3 flash here, I guess they would have just cast it probably, though. <sighs> yeah, you could play around the, the quench. Hmm. The problem is, if we bounce their stuff, they can just go bat, copy, bat. Which is pretty good. I think we just draw five, or just try and draw five and see what happens. We'll draw a removal spell in theory, too. Here we go, folks. We need this one. Need a big one here. Come on now. I got the loot, too. That's cute. Let's draw, let's draw a pyroclasm. One pyroclasm, please. This is going to go off anyway, so. Ill timed explosion costs three. Or it put a land, so. Maybe I should have. Oh, wow, he drew the five cards. Holy crap. Oh, but we bricked so hard, though. Oh, man, just a bunch of lands. All right, here's Tunnel Girder. That cascades. That's kind of gas. This deck does stuff, folks. This deck just does stuff. Um, loot again. Scar of Thundering Falls. Uh, discarding everything. So I want to keep a cavern for a dragon, right? So, do I want to keep Chandra? We're going to loot again, so, sure. Torch the tower. This is going to flip. No, it's not. There's no counters. Imagine taking so many game actions, you know? Land's legendary, but I would have mana up for Torch the Tower, which would be cool. Honestly, our hand's great. I don't even want to discard that much. I want to keep the cavern for a dragon. I guess I, I, I want to draw a dragon, though, so let's discard two more. All right. That was our combo turn, I guess. Did they have end step 4-3? Uh, our casino chances for dragon are a lot very weird. Each player draws, sure. Uh, we'll discard a moment of truth. We have a counter spell now too. <laughs> Here's Deep Cavern Bat. Good luck with that. They take the take one of the explosions. We just have, like, Wrath plus Counterspell up, you know, like. Yeah, Arena open tomorrow, and then Bronze. I'm going to do, I'm, I'm firing one bullet in the Arena open, and then we also have Bronze Mythic tomorrow, too. Kaido. Kaido is annoying, because it does not get hit by the L-Time explosion. Looks like I got to fight my way out of this one. Hmm. Your secrets didn't stay hidden for long. Uh, okay. Moment of truth. Like, do I try and combo? Do I... Chandra can kill this. Chandra can make mana, too. Uh, Five, two left over. Make two. Cast Explosion. Play a land. And then I can have Counterspell up, too. And Chandra can kill the... Oh, I want to kill the, the Kaido. This deck is pretty deranged. Minus four on Bat and Kaido. And then Torch the Tower, Bat, Mockingbird, have Counterspell up. Your, but I fought so hard. 
Start. This is once a turn it copies the spell. So copying the counter spell on their turn is pretty cool. Okay. Do I want a bargain? I don't think so. Okay. Uh Just stone nothing. Okay. Uh I'm going to add red red and cast an uncounterable hellraiser. Casino time, I guess. We have 16 cards in deck. They're going to shoot the sheriff. Uh... I should have used the, the rift, maybe. We can use three steps ahead and copy the Razor. They have Mastermind in hand. We're at eight. This is the hardest deck I've ever played in my entire life. Like, what I, I just have no idea what to do. Um, we can counter copy. That costs a lot of mana, though. Uh, that burns most of our mana for the entire turn. I think we just copy. Leave a blue. I have another one. And now I copy it. I really want that one to resolve, so do I just blue blue counter this? Yeah, so counter this. They have a third thing, discard a card. I'm just gonna decline, I think. I don't want a deck. Maybe it's fine, discard a Chandra. Discard a Chandra. Counter that. Copy this. Hellraiser. Torch the tower, ill-timed explosion. I guess we draw two. Just gonna decline. Just gonna decline. Decline. Copy. Hellraiser. I can spree this, but I have to pay the extra mana. Then I wanna have mana for the haste. Not that I necessarily need the mana for the haste. Okay, sure. It's a spree. Decline. Copy. Now we're out. I can't play these, so... Ooh, what's going on? Who do you think you are? I am! Alright, so... I would think Demir would beat the literal piss out of us, in theory. But, sure, we're going to bring in, like, negate, negate, these pyroclasms, shock, abrade, abrade, some, co some combination of this stuff. Uh, I would say the furnaces are kind of rough because they're sorcery speed. Artist talent was, like, okay that game. It just seems so, like, weird and finicky. Uh, I hate the unsummons, honestly. Cut the talents. I'm gonna shave her. Four reunions seems like way too many. You don't need that many, you know? Maybe shave a Chandra. It's just like too hard to, it's too hard to cast. I have no idea. I just have no idea. How are random effects? 
Really? Okay, I, I guess. It's like, kind of, sort of. But... Alright, so... I would have loved to have finished that match, unfortunately. Like, that's like one of the harder matchups, I would assume. Uh... I, I don't really have any words. Like, it, it's this deck reminds me a lot of, uh, like, Kaldheim Standard, where there were just so many different blue-red decks. You know, all Rins Epiphany decks. Uh, what were the other decks? There was, like, there were just, like, a bunch of big score decks where, like, these played big score and just, like, stuff. And they would just draw a bunch of cards and do weird things that were somewhat combo-adjacent and just kind of, like, do a lot of things and win. Um, I, I'm surprised for sure. You know, uh, it does feel like there's a little too much like looting stuff. Like the haste not reunion is pretty important, but I think four is kind of like whatever. The talent seems a little iffy, honestly. Um, obviously the deck seems weak to graveyard hate. I would love to find some way to, to like have some other win condition to kind of mitigate that. But that was... Pretty impressive. I mean, the mouse deck like, didn't draw. I mean, I mean, we got a little lucky. The mouse deck didn't draw many lands, etc. They scooped after one game, but yeah, I I don't know. I uh, now I feel more lost than I was when I started. So <laughs> more to play on stream. You folks, love you, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, yep, yeah, shit. Oof.